Okay. Hi. Hello. Hi. <laughs> um, first two um, Fed Cup matches in your career, yeah. right? Yes. And two great victories. Yes. So, how does it feel like? It feels great. I mean, to play the first time, to first win my singles yesterday against Israel was great. Of course, unfortunately, we lost the doubles, and but it was still, you know, it's great to play and to enjoy the atmosphere of the Fed Cup. And now today to win this important match was also, uh, that feels great. <laughs> yeah, how did you feel during the match? How was the match for you? Uh, it was a tough match. We played both good and I uh, have to play my yeah, a good level to uh, yeah, to beat her. I mean, she's also a very good player. So, um, but yeah, a little bit nervous sometimes. But when I played my game, she had troubles with it and I was able to turn around and to win it. <laughs> Best tennis memory so far, maybe together with Luxembourg last year? Yeah, it's everything. You know, it's different. It's different moments. I mean, Luxembourg is for yourself, and it's great, and it's achievement. You know, you you want to go there. I mean, you want to go to WTA, but Fed Cup, of course, you want to play. But it's a different. It's a different thing, actually. Yeah. <laughs> but still, yeah, great. And now Krajicek is playing, and then you will yeah. have to play the doubles. Uh, yeah. Hopefully I hope for you. To love up. Yeah. <laughs> So, what do you think will happen in the rest of your tie today? I have no idea, I'll just go sit and uh, enjoy uh, Misha and support her and then I hope she do, of course she does well and we'll see what happens, I have no idea. Um, okay, so you, you showed some really good tennis yesterday and today, so I was really really surprised to see that uh, 2011 was your first year in the, two w, in the WTA Tour. Um, until then you played only ITF, or mainly ITF, so what happened last year? Um, before that I was also uh, injured a lot, I didn't play uh, often, if I play I was like playing injured, playing injured. Um, I changed my um, uh, way of practicing, I practiced more, um, with an, working more mentally, we just sorted out some as aspects. Oh, in my game also, more aggressive, more to the net and everything. And yeah, that made me able to make this step uh, up from being 550 in March to being 154 right now. What do you mean that you had to, you, you, you doing more practicing every day? Tennis was not the first... Uh... Uh, yeah, no, we also did, I mean, it was just a different schedule. We decided to change some stuff, including the tennis, to do uh, some extra in it, some mental. We just we said we want a different approach and we see yeah we go for it we see how it goes and it yeah it worked out great. <laughs> Your parents gave you a deadline regarding tennis. Who told you? <laughs> you read it somewhere. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Last year in 2010, we were sitting with the coach like listen something has to happen now uh, we're gonna change this way of practicing and next year is a key year if you don't be between two and three hundred by the end of the year then we're finished. So it was. I dropped at Mar in March uh, from 450 to 550 and I was like, crap, <laughs> this is going to be a tough year. <laughs> and then uh, two months later I won two 25s in a row and I was top 300. So I called my dad and I'm like, hey dad, I'm 300. <laughs> so yeah. So tennis it is. So, tennis is. <laughs> so um, what are your plans for 2012? Um, of course I will play some extra uh, WTA events to try, uh, I mean I qualified my last one and um, yeah to improve to see if I can go towards the top 100, I mean it would be great and we'll see, I just keep working hard, keep doing my things and uh, if I have the level I will get there. Okay. Thank you very much. No problem and see you later. Yeah. <laughs>